Now, we're gonna do that now our OBS Studio. First, you're going to look that on Google, OBS Studio. There you are, you have OBS Studio or download, whichever you can click that. Now you have three options that one for your PC, for your Mac, or your laptop. But for now, um, we're going to uh, do the on the computer, Windows. So you click the Windows and then uh, it will download here if you use Chrome. And then it, you'll see that if, when it's finished, you can click that. If it's not automatically show the, you know, when it it did not pop up, so you can uh, click that or you just wait uh, to pop up the window for the box. Now you have that next. You click the next, and we are on the OBS Studio 30.1. So you just click the next. And then you can read this, uh, that uh, thing that they have information and you click next. And then this one is your program file. If you want to store in this OBS Studio or some other, it's up to you. But it's good that not to ch not to change it. So go install and you have to wait until it finish installing. The um, it will uh, once it's finished it's going to be easier for you to look up and check the you know the appearance of the OBS studio so and usually I use that on my laptop or my computer I don't know if it's available on the Android phone, phones or uh, iPhones I'm not sure but uh, this uh, this is the one I'm using in my uh, live streaming so um, it's a bit uh, hard only to understand at first but you could start on the simplest way you know and that will learn you more so now when it's finished you click the finish and it will launch your OBS studio so this one browser will just gonna minimize that one later. So there you are, your OBS Studio. And you see that, um, the appearance of that, uh, just, we're just gonna minimize that browser and we'll maximize the browser of the OBS. And there you are, your OBS Studio shortcut. Now let's make it bigger screen, there you are. Now you have this audio mix mixer. You have desktop audio and the microphone of your, uh, if you have a microphone available. And this one is seen and sources when you make your um, stream. We're not going to explain that yet, but uh, we're just going to have a setup. We'll do uh, talk about that next time. And this part is your control menu. You have start streaming, start recording, and everything there. You can click that too. And you have also in the file. And usually you're gonna use the setting most of the time. So we're going just to use one by one for uh, for our setup. And with the video, you have your screen size or your resolution, and it come up like that. So if your internet is good, um, this is already average. But I use 1920 by 720, and it's a perfect screen for me. Uh, and then the common FPS value is 30. You don't have to change anything much on that. Uh, okay, and then. You also have to check on the settings the the other thing that you need to uh, consider when you do the stream. You gonna go to audio, and usually you have only two things yet: one of your speaker and one for your microphone. If you using external, then it will go on the drop down menu, and you can use that on. For now. That's it, and you don't have to.
change match to or choose so you're just gonna leave that way you don't have any external uh, um, gadgets so you just look at it what is in it and then you just can the copy and then one also thing is the Next one is the output. The output also is all there. You don't have to change. And usually that bit, bit, bit rate is important. This 2005 is the minimum that they have when, you're, uh, when your uh, internet is okay. But when you have a fast internet, you can make it faster. But for now, you don't have to change. And you can only do that once you get used to your uh, OBS. So just check all that and you just um, click uh, OK when you are done. Okay, as I said, I will not explain more of the OBS, we're just setting it up and next time I'll talk more about the scenes and the sources. So uh, we're going to close it for now and uh, I'll see you next time to explain more about OBS and don't forget that you have your shortcut before it's the excess of OBS and I will see you next time for now that's it